just for practice, we'll go through another percent measure problem. So in this problem, we have 500 milliliters of D5NS, and we're asked about the dextrose and the sodium chloride. So in our abbreviation for our IV fluid, D5, we know stands for 5% dextrose. So 5% is 5 over 100. And we know that sugar, dextrose, is measured as a solid, so that's grams. And we're making an IV fluid, so that's milliliters. So 5 grams per 100 milliliters. We want to know how many grams will we need if we have 500 milliliters. And we'll solve that using a cross product, so 100x is equal to 2500, divide both sides by 100, and we get x is 25 grams of the dextrose. So then we want to do our second half of the problem, so the NS, the normal saline, Normal saline we need to memorize is 0.9% sodium chloride. And so we want to turn that 0.9% into a fraction. And again, these look a little odd, but we put 0.9 over 100 because we know percent is per 100. Salt is a solid, so measured in grams, mixed with liquid, so in 100 ml. We want to know how many grams there will be in 500 mLs. And again, cross products. So 100x is equal to 0.9 times 500, which will give me 450. Divide by 100 on both sides. And we end up with x being 4.5 grams. And so again, as we look at all of the details, we found that this IV has 25 grams of the dextrose, that's the sugar, and we found that it has 4.5 grams of the salt from the normal saline, and then the remaining piece is that it would have 500 ml of water, and that's what the other two ingredients are dissolved in.